Hi, it's Steve from Parts Select. In this video, we'll explain in layman's terms how an air conditioner really works. Regardless of the type of air conditioner, be it a portable, a window mount, a ductless mini split, or a whole home HVAC system, the principles on how they operate are virtually the same. Now, there are a few key components that are common to any type of air conditioning system. First would be the temperature control. This may be either a solid state device such as a thermistor or in older window mount units, you may find a hydraulic type control instead. Next, we'll have an evaporator coil. These will typically have some aluminum fins on them to help absorb heat. Next, we'll have a condenser coil, again, with aluminum fins on it to help dissipate heat. You'll also have one or more motor driven fans to circulate air. And lastly, we'll have a compressor with associated refrigerant tubing attached. Now basically how the system will work is when the thermostat is activated by the temperature in the room reaching the set point, power is then supplied to the compressor and perhaps the fan motors. The compressor will pressurize the refrigerant gas into a hot liquid as it enters the condenser coil. The fan will force air through that condenser coil and dissipate or expel that heat into the atmosphere. As the refrigerant leaves the condenser coils, it travels through the capillary tube to the evaporator. As the liquid refrigerant enters the evaporator, the pressure drops suddenly. The refrigerant returns to a gaseous state and the temperature is reduced dramatically. Room air is then pulled across the evaporator coils by the motor driven fan. As the air passes over the fins on those evaporator coils, heat is absorbed and the cooled, drier air is then recirculated back into the room. When the thermostat or temp sensor is satisfied, power to the compressor is removed and the process stops. Some models do, however, allow the fan motors to continue to circulate air. To maximize the efficiency of your air conditioner, it's very important that you keep your filters clean. You will typically find a filter on the inlet to your evaporator to prevent dirt from building up there. On some models, you may also find a filter near the condenser coils. And it is again important that you keep those clean at all times. Thank you so much for watching this video. We certainly hope that you now understand how an air conditioner can keep you cool. For more information on maintenance and cleaning tips, or how to choose the proper size air conditioner for your home, be sure to check out our other videos. And remember to subscribe so you don't miss a thing.